Hello guys, today I will be teaching you how to install mod security, where to go in order to modify the configurations, and then how to remove mod security towards the end. So let's start off by just quickly doing an apt get update and then an apt get upgrade. I always like doing this, it's just a good practice anytime you sit down at a console, get familiar with doing an apt get update and apt get upgrade. Now you can put those together by doing something like this. And then it's going to do the update followed by the upgrade. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to type app get install lib apache2 hyphen mod security. This is going to prompt us if we would like to install mod security and it should go ahead and automatically have it started up so it did go ahead and try to get that going there so now we're gonna go ahead and type apache ctl hyphen m this is just gonna show us all the modules that are running and if we want what we can do is we can grep this for security and you can see that our security2 module is indeed running, which means that mod security is, in fact, a running module. So right now what we can do is cd slash etc slash mod or mod s tab. That's going to show us mod security. We're going in this directory and we want to ls uh, whatever is inside of here. So. This is a recommended config file, and what we can do is we can copy this recommended config file over to this without the, the you'll, you'll see what I mean when I ls again. So here we have modsecurity.conf, which is good, and if we wanted to, we can do a little cool trick in this file. I'm going to show you that at a later time, but let's just pretend that you have mod security all set up here and then all of the sudden you decide hey you know what I really hate mod security I just want it gone right so let's just CD back to our, our main directory let's clear this stuff away just to to get a fresh mind and what you are going to want to do is apt get purge auto hyphen remove and here you're just gonna type lib apache 2 hyphen mod security now it's going to ask you if you want to do this. Just yes, confirm that you want this removed. So here it's just going to go ahead and disable mod security from your Apache server. Then it's also going to say that ETC mod security is not empty. So what we want to do is come in to ETC and let's just RM space hyphen capital R and we're just going to put down mod security, right? So now if we ls, we have everything in here, but now if we try to go into mod security, that's not a directory. We just recursively went through and wiped out that entire directory, including mod security. Be careful with that command. You can go overkill with that and literally end up just destroying your machine. So. Be careful anytime that you're doing an RM, and yeah, I guess just make sure that you know what you're, you know what you're doing. Uh, so that's how you would go about installing mod security and then uninstalling mod security. I hope that you have found this useful. I have another tutorial coming up here real shortly.